Salutations everybody, it's Jay Tetra, and today we're going to be playing Slime Rancher. Now I know this is a bit older of a game, but I mean, come on, it is just, it's just really cute. I, I can't resist. So we're just going to go ahead and start a new game here. Call this game one. Actually, you know what? You know what? Let's make this name. We're going to go... Tet... Tot... Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, is this my name? Okay, we're just gonna do Tet Tot then. Uh, adventure, live the life of Slime Rancher, and explore the wonders of the far. R range at your far, far range at your own pace. Casual, a relaxed take on adventure mode without any threat of tar slime or rush. Race against the clock to earn as many new bucks as possible. I'm not doing that. Let's just do this the classic adventure Our icon. Oh, they're so cute. Oh Who do I want? Who do I want? Oh. I think I think we're gonna go with the white lucky cat slime That's the one that's the one. This is perfect, guys. Already off to a great start. This is going to be a fun one. I, I, ju I just know it. <laughs> that red, the red slime in the back of the loading screen. I mean, that things look crazy right now. Did my game just freeze? Oh, no. Okay. I honestly thought the game just froze right now. A thousand light years away from Earth on a planet known as the Far Far Range, Beatrix LeBeau begins her first day as a slime rancher. Ooh. Let's get moving. Well, that was easy. Jump. Boom. Ooh. It's gonna go ahead and do this. I don't know how to skip the tutorial. I have played this game before. Now I will say I never made it far into it. Cause I just, I just got, I like numbers, you know? So I just tried to gain as much money as possible. We're gonna pick up a few of you guys. Now these guys are pink slimes. They will pick up anything. They, they, they eat any kind of food, anything. You put it in their face, mm, bon appetit. They will smack it down. Honestly, I think nine is a little much to start, but we're gonna get these guys back into our base. I'm just gonna one, two, three, four, five. I I try not to go above five when I'm starting out, just because that that ledge is just so small, and it'll these slimes they're they're crafty, they're crafty people. They will just hop right out of this guy, no questions asked. And Bob's your uncle. There goes your money supply. What am I? What am I? Yeah, uh, you want me to feed a slime? Nope, here you go. I don't need any of that right now. We'll pick up. So, this game, it's just. It's just a really cute and relaxed game. It does get stressful later once uh once you get into high populous areas with a lot of tar slimes. Can you are there can I have a plort please? Can I, can I have a plort? I don't want Oh yeah, by the way, these slimes, yep, they just poop everywhere and you know what? I pick that up. That's my income. That is my job. I am a nine to five Pooper Scooper. And I love everything about that. I can't remember if you like vegetables or if you like fruit, but I know you like one of those. I want one of your plorts so that I can just mix you with... No, don't eat my chicken. Just in case. Just in case. We're gonna head back. Just because I want these guys by my base. F off. Fruit. 
All right, now I have one of every kind of food, so I can get pink, or I can get, um, plort. I guess I could just take a pink plort and... I could just take a pink plort. I already put slime in there. Yeah, sure. Boom. There's a slime. There's a slime. There's a slime. Oh, they like vegetables. Okay, dope. Yep. Now the other guys should eat the... Yes. That's what we want. That is the good good. Oh, that is some loud right there. I want this. I do need someone. Can I buy any upgrades right now? I can't remember. I just want high walls. Can I get high walls? 350! Outlandish! I'll do it. 22. Mm. Oh, yeah, here's the thing, too. Your income is so inconsistent. So, your income is basically like a stock market. You never know how much you're gonna get. You go through the night, next thing you know, boom, price change. Now, I think it's based off of what I sell the most of. It goes down, which becomes really tedious later in the game. But it, 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 it'll, it'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. I want this. Can I have this? Thank you. Um, hungry? Anyone? Oh yeah, we got, we got some hungry boys. I would like your plorts. They're only worth ten, but that means I only need ten. I think I saw. It. I did. Oh, you're just a pink slime. I thought you were a plort. I want your poop, please. Poop all over me. That is what I want. I would like to suck up your fecal matter and put it in a tube. I just want the high walls. I need the high walls. <clears throat> I need the high walls so I can keep these... Oh, what are they called? They're not... Are these... These are the Gordos, aren't they? I'm pretty sure. I can't remember what these guys are called. Largo! You're the Largos! Anyways, while I still have all my Largos... Alright, add those on there. I have the 350. Huh. This game is like a straight right-to-work game. Put some high walls on. But look at this guy. Look at this happy boy. Look at him. Come here. Look at this happy boy. Oh, you just don't. Oh my, Largo. Largo slimes are large slime hybrids. Formed when a slime eats a floor unlike its own. Hmm. Have a fruit. Somebody, anybody. So, also, slimes have a favorite food. I believe every slime except for pink, because pink usually eats just about anything. Which means they're kind of not picky about it. So we're just gonna keep on going. Keep on going. Alright, um... Uh, no, I don't want you. What I want to do now is I want to... Yes, I want to collect floors. I need to save up money. I need to build a farm. Um... And, and something that I found is, if you play the game right, if you play the game right, you'll never need to actually collect meat, which is good, because meat is such a tedious thing to actually maintain on a farm in this game. Like, honestly, it's just, it's such a hard thing to do. But it's, it's doable. I mean, I will say a lot of high value slimes usually require like a meat or a rare thing. But if you fuse it with something else, and you give it that favorite food, you still get double plorts. Which is very important. Alright, so this this is one of those chaos areas. See the- I don't have what you need! I don't have it! I don't have it! I don't have it! I'm sorry! This is the lucky slime. I can't remember what you feed it, but you feed it something, and it gives you tons and tons of money. 
And there, there are two ways to fight a tar if one does pop out. Um, the easiest way is to splash it with water. But being that I do not have water yet... Is that one? No. Being that I don't have a water supply yet, I have to just kind of keep watching out to make sure... Oh, you must have ate a stony hen. Yeah, I know some of these guys' favorite foods, but... Man, we are playing a dangerous game staying here for an extended period. Is there any more plorts? I think these are all the plorts I can get right now. Oh, I don't even have a jetpack yet. Ah. Oh. So, yeah, like I said, I have played this game before. Um, I never made it very far, and by that I mean I never made it, like... There's a, there's a, an area in which you have to put slimes, plorts, into statues. And I've never finished that. I've seen a couple YouTubers play this game too, like other YouTubers. And I think the one that did this game the most justice was probably Jacksepticeye. But I didn't watch his videos all the way through either. I was busy with work at the time. And just ended up falling behind. And I'm sure the rest of you know how that story goes. But we're gonna toss on some of these. How much does it cost for me to make a farm? I would like a garden. Two for me. I'll do that. Pet, now I need to go grab some carrots. Carrots are the end all be all of vegetables. And so long as my slimes are mixed with pinks, then it doesn't matter if it is carrot. I just need the one. I'm gonna grab some more though so I can feed my cute boys. Gonna do it. Gonna feed my boys. Gonna feed my boys. Boom. Oh, that sweet poop. Ah, I, I mean, plor, plor, plor. <laughs> I just, I can't, this is such a wild concept to me. You're, you're playing a game. You're playing an absolutely beautiful game. Can you, are you guys just not gonna, if you guys are not gonna play by my rules, you will not play. Actually, I want one more. I like having five of each slime. I don't know why it became that number. Obviously, I know if I have more slimes, I could make more money. Well, you didn't see that. And uh, also, oh, I forgot about this. You can get little missions. Are you in exchange? I'm offline. I'm going to collect these. That's for sure. Then I'm going to rest until day. That's something you can do, is you can sleep until morning, which is nice. Cause it's not dangerous to play at night. In fact, there are some slimes you can only get at night. But it's just so much easier to be able to, you know, see where I'm going and what I'm doing. All right, I'm gonna feed my my angry, hungry boys. Yes, I see you're very upset. See, look at that. Carrots, grow, and I'll be all. Yes. Line those bad lads up in there. These boys will eat them. Ouch, ouch, ouch. I see you're angry. Ouch, I'm just trying to pick up your poop. Okay, well, you know, if you're gonna be like that, then you can stew in your own stew. That was a bad joke. Not a good delivery on that one. Seven. We were ten yesterday. 
Oh, hey, you went up, though. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That is good. That is good. Good, 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 good. So I don't really care about the auto feeder. I mean, it's nice if I'm going on long adventures, but I'm normally never gone long enough for my slimes to go hungry. I try to be back by the end of each day. I don't normally spend the night times out. It does happen, but what I want is Plort Collection, so I still need more Plorts. So... what about that? I can... you know, I'll, I'll show you I'll show you a little bit more. I also need to eventually just buckle down and buy the jetpack. This game is just so cute. Yeah, and that's, that is something that is just the best. I mean, not really. These guys, plorts, no, they are not worth much, but you can find them anywhere. Like, in surplus, never out of stock, like, just everywhere. These guys are like seagulls, and they poop, or pigeons too. Pigeons fall under this category. They will poop all day, every day, if they can. It goes in one side and comes out the other faster than you can say butterscotch. And I can say butterscotch pretty fast. Where are, I want more of you, plorts. Just give me, give me more of yours. Don't want you. I just said, oh my god. <laughs> Welcome back, little guy. You want to go on another trip? <laughs> Look at that. He just fell right back down and whoosh. <laughs> Perfectly fine. What the heck? I've never actually done that before. I don't normally just launch them straight up. Aw. That's okay. No, 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 don't you dare. Bing! Yeah, go bing yourself. And give me more of your plorts. You guys, you hungry? Hungry? You guys hungry? Give me. I got some more money. About 160 bucks worth. Well, 100, 180 bucks worth? Sir, 23. So, 7, 140. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna have enough to get what I want. I'm an idiot. Look, it's just a little slime mouth. That's what it is. Not a lot of people actually notice that, but it actually is designed to look like a slime, eating all the plorts. Oh! And, uh... Um... I can't remember if it's the sun is also a slime. I know the moon is a slime. When the moon comes out, I'll show you guys. But I do know... I'm not sure if the sun is a slime. I only know about the moon. As like a 100%. Oh, I'm so cool. I love you. That makes up for you beating my butt earlier. Uncalled for. Alright. Give me that floor collector. Now, that is what is important because that thing will pull in all of the plorts that they have. So, what I want to do. Next, I need to make you grow carrots faster. I'm gonna go grab some food, stock them up. It should be nighttime by then. Should be, I say should be lightly. I don't remember how fast time moves in this game. Ooh. Trying to avoid picking up those pink guys. I don't know if any of you have played this game. If you haven't, I mean, it's fun. If you like a relaxed game, 
that you just get to explore these wild areas and, and just see the cutest little doodads. I mean, once again, look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at that smile. Look at that smile. Anyways, if you like exploration games that are just nothing but like a relaxed and cute little adventure, this is definitely one to go to. We're gonna give our boys a little treat. From the west! Oh, Thora West. Okay, we'll go check that out. Welcome to the range from Thora West. Welcome to the range exchange, Thora West. Hi there, Beatrix. The name's Thora West. I'll keep my introduction short on the account that we've all got work to do. It's a long... I'm a long-time rancher here on the Far Far Range and head of the welcome wagon on your local range exchange. The range exchange is a network of ranchers just like yourself who are looking to trade what they got for what they need. Slimes, plorts, food, whatever. All you need to do is check out the range exchange machine daily and be sure to get your trade completed within 24 hours. As more ranchers get added to your network, you should receive a hearty hello from them. So check your inbox. Rise and shine, Casey. Hi, Bay. B, Bay, B, Bia. Eh. What's it like to sleep for a whole year? Did you dream? I can't imagine what that's like. S Seven Z E E puts you in a good, puts you in a pod, and then lights out for all that time. Wow. What's the far, far range like? Have you started exploring? Is the air as clear as they say? I bet it's really beautiful. It is. It is pretty beautiful. I guess I better... Or I'm probably asking too many questions. I bet you have a lot of work to do on that ranch. I still can't believe it's yours now. I guess I better leave it to you and just keep it short. Good luck, B. If anyone can make it out there, it's you. Aww! Casey! I love that. Vetoing that one. That one seemed disinteresting. Okay, yeah, so this is the range exchange. You can you can do this. Thor West. So these, these are a plort you can only get at night. So she wants four pink plorts, four carrots, and a stony hen. That's see, this is what I'm saying. And that's not worth the trade. Stony hens are a pain to find. Actually, this is worth the trade because I want that that crisp 500. But that's beside the point. All right, so you want pink plorts? Two. Hello? Please poop on me. I would I would like I would enjoy that, please. Just, just pop it, pop it right here in front of me. I'm, I'm accepting it all right now. Maybe if I, maybe if I get this train started a little bit. I mean, I know you wanted carrots, but like, plorts are also important. Uh, yep, perfect. That's what we wanted. Alright, now the only place I can think of that I would be able to find a stony hen, it is a new day. I swear to god, if I just watched you eat a stony hen, I'm gonna be... Does she want a stony rooster or a stony hen? No time, we'll try to grab them both. Alright, so I have to be quick in other words. Yeah, in other words, those fuckers eat everything. No! Nope! Save you! Come here! Ugh! Oh. Yeah, those fuckers, they will eat all of them. Oh, see, that noise. That's the bad noise. So that... Where'd he go? Hello? I know you're around here. I can hear you. There he is. That is a tar. Tars are bad news bears. That's an easy way to deal with them. And you usually don't get that lucky. Yeah, I should have just about everything I need to get back. I think I just need some carrots now. Wait, were you a stony hen? No. I have stony. So 
we'll just run over here and grab these carrots really quick. Yeah, screw your ecosystem. I'm just kidding, I love you. I love you all. So it's just, uh, once again, it's just such a cute game. So we're gonna do this really quick. We're gonna complete our first mission. So you want four carrots. One, two, three, four. Yes! Give it to me. That's the ticket. Give me the ticket. Give it to me, baby. Yeah, I don't care about a very angry pink slime. Yeah, there's no food here for you to eat. I would like all the muns, please. Thank you. I could have mixed them, but I don't want to. Um, so next, actually, I'm gonna upgrade my person before I upgrade that. So, well, I don't want the hat, and I... There, thank you. It would, it, I'm sorry, it wouldn't let me move up and down. It was like I had a notification on there, but it wasn't showing me what it was, so... Eh. Power core, that comes in handy after, actually that just comes in handy in general. 700, so I'm gonna get, so watch your back, the whole 30 units, whatever. That's not important right now. We're gonna get the jetpack. our energy. Yes. Also, at some point during this series, I am going to show you how to break the game a little bit, if you are prepared to break the game. It's, it's not like a huge thing that you're just going to make a ton of money, no. It's more of just like a way to get ahead of where you're supposed to be and also give you the most amazing view in the game. Now, I did originally, when I did it, try to uh, message the developers, and they never got back to me, never acknowledged it, and I know you can still do it. So, I will show you that at some point. But until then, that is all the time that I have for this episode. We have our farm started. We have our... We have our pink rocks, we have our garden, we have money, we have a jetpack. So, until next time, you know, thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you leave a like and comment down below telling me what you liked about it or ways that I can improve. And if you liked me, make sure you subscribe so you can see more awesome content like this one. But until then, that's all I got. It was nice seeing you. Bye.